Hi guys, uh, it's Trenty. Uh, today I bought two oils uh, from a representative uh, from a company. This company is medium size. Uh, they are quite uh, reputable because I read their feedbacks on their website and uh, according to the size of the company, they owe several plantation. So I have put a lot of trust in them and i just want to find out uh, what is the 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 scent of these other wood smell like so i order uh the two bottles of them um three, uh, six mil each however uh because i don't like name and shame so i did not um i did not put uh put the the original bottles here so i extract uh two to oils into our own vial to uh, to show you now the one on the left the one on the left um, the brown color I called it X and the one that has the black color I called it uh, a Y um, the smell was this this X one the smell was alright um, it's woody but it's plain um, it's not special it's don't have a strong impression but um, this black one now they call it uh, standard grade it feel like a musky and doesn't feel like wood at all but I asked the rep and he confirmed this is 100% uh, pure so you know if you are in my positions what can you do if you ask for a GCMS and they don't have it, um, you can do it yourself by following the below method. Alternatively, if you um, you know have the mean to to do the lab test um, in your country, uh, feel free to do so. Um, but in this case, I show you a simple way to tell if these wood oil are genuine or not. So, wait for me, I'm gonna get some water, put into these two, and I'll show you next. Alright guys. So, so you can see. Um, I put uh, water in and uh, this is called X you see uh, after put the water in you can see the color the water is not clear and the oil floating it's um, it's consistent it seems like only one substance, uh, one one oil inside this bottle. Now, essential oil is not soluble uh, in water. We know that, but also there will be a small amount of uh, oil is uh, is soluble in in water. So that's why the water is not quite clear. Uh, in other words, this oil is not um, cured or treated long enough. To remove all the insoluble um, or the soluble uh, components out, because usually after you um, during the distillation, you will find the water is it's not clear, not transparent because something is mixed in it. We actually filter them out, and we only take uh, the top part of the oil, and we do it several times until um, the water is clear, so the oil is stable. In this case, uh, you can see. Uh, the water is, is not clear the oil uh, float on the top it could be pure but um, they contain some some part that uh, soluble in, in water that's why the water is not clear so that's my um, my conclusion on this now to to find out exactly what it is you need to send to the lab but in this case um i i can't be certain but uh, by the look at it i i think i think 
uh, the oil is, is not uh, super great as they mentioned because it's not treated well enough the water is, is not clear now with the what with with the uh, with the wild oil right they uh, they claim that um, this is a pure oil 100% pure wood oil but uh, if you look at it um, you can see first the water is not clear now second um, second you can see it's uh, it's everywhere you can see there's uh, different droplets in everywhere and uh, the density is different too because the the one that lighter on uh, with, uh, compared to water float the one that heavier than water drop and um, you know the middle one will be um, the density will become one same with the water but as you can see uh, some float some sink and uh, some in the middle so this oil is not actually pure there are more than one oil in in this um, this white oil they claim it's pure but from what you see there are three different um, uh, positions uh, bottoms uh, middles and and on the top so um, in conclusion this is not pure wood oil this is something like uh, a perfume or an, an atta which um, although the smell is nice it's very powdery but it's certainly uh, not pure aga wood oil so there you have it uh, next time if you um, if you if you uh, want to know if if the oil is pure uh, you can simply add water uh, into the vial and shake so when you shake uh, the true color reveal and you can tell if, it, if it's uh, adulterated so in short if the water is unclear it means um, the oil is not treated well enough but it quite consistent because most of the oil float on the top so uh, you know it's you can you can say it's pure wood oil but it's not treated well but with the while um, they say that uh, uh, you know super great or standard grade whatsoever whatever they name it you put the water in you shake and you can see um, you know some in the bottom some in the middle some in the, the top it's not consistent that means there are more than one oil inside this bottle and uh, it's not pure so there you have it see you next time hi guys I'm back again uh, the last video I show you um, what is not pure so in this case um, I show you what you expected in uh, pure wood oil now these two are from us, uh, distilled by us. So um, and we have GCMS too. Now, I'm not doing promotion or anything, so I, I don't I don't want to name and shame. Um, I just name it hydro wood oil. That means the wood oil that uh, distilled by water. The second one is uh, CO two extracted oil. So you can see here, right? I shake violently. And leave it aside, let it settle. This shake violently. Leave it aside, let it settle. Alright guys, um, I pause for 20 seconds. So it's settle now. Um, you can see most of the oil float on the top. Um, and you see the X1 I mentioned is it's not it's it's maybe poor but it's not treated well. You can uh, compare the uh, transparency of, of the water. Um, the the hydro wood oil that's genuine, one hundred percent wood oil. Uh, the water is pretty clear compared to to the eggs. Um, one is clearer. The second one is, is cloudy. Now the reason for for is clearer because it has been uh, treated well and uh, filtered uh, many times until. Uh, there's no soluble components left in 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 the hydro hydro wood oil so the water is clear uh, the x1 is not so here's the co2 now with co2 the oil will sink the reason is 
uh, only long chain uh, molecules from the um, from the oil from from the agar wood resin uh, is extracted, and um, this method CO two extracted um, will will have a heavier oil, higher density oil. As you can see, the oil more likely sink, and uh, yeah, it's it's genuine because we do it so we know. Um, you know, I'm talking about you know some consumer, someone like you that uh, doesn't have access to uh, GCMS and um, you want to want to do a quick test so this is the way you do it again you know CO2 oil sink hydro wood oil float and the water is clear it's transparent uh, cloudy X is so right you know it may not be treated well but it could be uh, it could be uh, pure but um, it not it's not uh, filter well enough the wire is not pure because it's not consistent you know it's um, is there are more than one oil in, in, in this um, in this vial and they claim it's 100% pure my conclusion is not okay next time